crew is being held hostage around the city. I won't abandon them. I found the mutilated body Cash was talking about. I'm going to try and establish a cause of death. Blood tests reveal the cause of death was an overdose of painkillers leading to cardiac arrest. Also, the victim's fingerprints have been burned off with acid. A rather unsavory demise. That's not all. It's as though the subject's DNA has been corrupted somehow. There's insufficient information for me to cross-reference the database. I'll have to use the deep tissue scanner to analyze the body for distinguishing features and determine the victim's identity. Right you are, sir. so it must have been recent. Alfred, the victim's name is Anthony Lund. Hospital records show he suffered with alcoholism, most probably brought on by the breakdown of his marriage. The name on the ring, Ophelia, his ex-wife. He was last seen in Albuquerque, New Mexico. What's unusual is that they didn't go missing in Gotham. They were brought here and killed. Why? We need to track down whoever did this. Might I suggest keeping an ear out for any more of that ghastly opera music? It sounds ominously like a calling card.
I won't leave the missing fire crew to die. I will find them. I'm going to the train yard. Enigma's planning something. We all Detective, yes, it's me, your most feared nemesis, the Riddler. Congratulations are in order, for you have arrived early for this, the next generation of my riddles. I'm afraid the full particulars of my plan will have to remain unannounced for the time being. But I see no harm in rewarding the harmless little glimmer of initiative you have shown with a sneak peek, a preview, if you will, of the kind of conundrum I have in store. It begins. You are staring, <clears throat> with stupefied incomprehension, at a mechanism I have calibrated to respond to an extremely precise radar pulse. In a moment, I will give you the decrypted code, Dark Knight. Oh, but first, I think we should run through the ground rules for tonight's festivities. Rule the first. What? What? How did you how, how did you solve tonight's very first riddle? <laughs> well done. Well done. Welcome to my racetrack, detective. You must complete three circuits of this gauntlet, finishing each before the time limit expires. Spires. Spires. Come now, detective. Let's put that grotesque ego mobile to the test. Be ready, Dark Knight. There's more to this test than just going rum, rum, really fast. Tick tock, detective. Tick tock. Ramshackle motor handle this. Faster, Dark Knight, faster! Can those flickering, faltering synapses keep up with my automatically adjusting course? Disabling the afterburner's failsafe. I need the extra speed. I'm shocked, Dark Knight. Is that really as fast as it goes? Let's work that undeveloped brain of yours. Detective, go left. Go. Oh, Detective, what's that I hear? Is it time winged chariot hurrying near? You're close, Detective. Don't fumble now. Don't, don't, don't fumble now. Hurry up, Detective. You stand marginally more of a chance of succeeding if you actually begin. 
Congratulations, Detective. You have defeated me. Seriously, Dark Knight, I'm stunned, humiliated, utterly bested. Time I gave up, I think. Why don't you head on your way? <laughs> Did you really believe that a challenge designed by me, the Riddler, would be quite so easy? Oh, Dark Knight. You sweet, naive sentinel. Of course it wouldn't. Still, thanks to your unrelenting desire to showboat, I now have several hundred terabytes worth of performance data relating to that latest model of rocket-powered hearse you're driving. Naturally, I shall be using this data to calibrate further challenges and trials. I'll see you soon, Detective. There's a lot more to come. I'm heading to the clock tower to see what Oracle's found on Scarecrow's toxin. Let's hope it's good news, sir. <laughs>